Hello people, what's up? My name is Mark and welcome back to Vampire Survivors. Last time we played as Poe on the milk factory. Dairy... Dairy... Dairy plant? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> and of course we lost before 38 minutes, but never mind that. Today we are going to play as Clarici, Clarici, Clariki. I don't know how to pronounce that. Anyway, there's one really interesting thing with Clary something. Uh, that is, the area of weapons is 410% for first couple couple turns. Permanent plus 0 0.5 HP a second and 50 max health. Ooh, starts with temporary area bonus. Anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna hold off uh, of these characters on a dairy plant because you know I I kind of want to go to the these guys so. Yeah, let's start with Clarici on the Mad Forest. On Hyper, of course. Um, so, this is what I'm talking about. Look at the area of damage. Just look at the freaking area of damage. And now, when we hit level 2... Okay. Now, when we hit level 2, you see? It's a bit smaller. Oh my god, they're so fucking huge. Now, when we hit level 3... It's going to be even smaller. Is it smaller? I don't know honestly, but it's it's big. It's still still really big. I think by the by the time you hit level five, it's just um, back at at like normal, you know. I do believe so. Oh yeah, King Bible for sure. See, hundred and ten. And now when we actually hit level 5, we are going to be on uh, normal, I guess. Although I don't even know what normal is. My lord, the King Bible is so far away. Look at that. Okay. And here we go. We're going to take the Candle Labrador. 20. Because of the Candle Labrador. So now everything is back. First time when I played this Clarici, I had such a good chuckle because I, I didn't, I, I honestly didn't expect what I what I have seen, what I saw, whatever. And it was so damn funny. I swear, it was so damn funny. So as you can see, the Clarici starting with Santa's water. Uh, I think yesterday or a couple days ago. Let's go with the tractor because it was. The evolution of Santa's water. A labora. I saw somebody on the Discord, Vampire Survivors Discord, um, said that Santa's water in, in Italian literally means uh, holy water. So, you know, that's just a. Uh, I get a word. Get. I guess a word play on, on the Italian language or something. I don't know. But that's fine. Uh, let's go with the Candle Labrador. I'm gonna stay away from the knives. Because I really kinda don't want them. I cannot say that I don't want the knives. But um, I'm gonna try to stay away from them. That's about it. Oh lordy, we have... Uh, sure... Anyway, we have 30% curse from the get-go because at the end of the last episode I did buy level 3 curse in the store. Only two more levels to 50. Oh yeah, let's go with the King Bible. Oh my god, look at it, look at that, look at this, oh my god, look at that. Look, looky, looky. Just looky, looky, we have three of them, which is amazing and great. What are we looking for? The Spellbinder, of course. Uh, sure, Santa's Water. Anyway, yeah, the Spellbinder. That was bad, that was bad, but never mind. And why I didn't take the level level 4, level 4, yeah, level 3, uh, King Bible? Well, that's because I cannot... I, I don't have the Spellbinder. Which means I'm gonna I'm gonna try to level up the weapons that I can actually evolve first, and then after that we're gonna see what we're gonna do. 
with everything else. Of course, if in the meantime I do get the Spellbinder, I know exactly what I'm going to do, and how I'm going to do it, and why I'm going to do it. And we got a Spellbinder. There we go. So we have three evolutions ready, basically. Now we need to work toward, towards everything else. What do I want? Well, I mean, we've shown, of course. Just because, you know. Just because it's a Pichon, is the strongest weapon in the game. Almost going toe-to-toe -to -toe with Rune Tracer. I'm just kidding, Rune Tracer is garbage. I'm just kidding, Rune Tracer is by far the strongest uh, non-evolution weapon. And also stronger than, than many evolutions, which is dumb. But that's fine, that's fine. I, I, I still don't know, like, I usually don't take the uh, Rune Tracer, however, I do believe I will need to take it on, on the Milk Factory. Dairy, dairy, dairy plant, there we go, dairy plant. I do believe that I will I will need to take take it there. King Bible, thank you. What do I want from the weapons? Seriously though. Oh area is 40%, nice. Not really, but okay. What do I want from the weapons? Let's go. Now we have 40% luck, which is really great. Um Santa's water, perfect. Oh my lord, can you can you freak off? Just uh, just for a tad bit. Okay. Do I want to go with the garlic? I probably do actually. Yeah, yeah, I usually do this build. Okay, okay. I'm I'm taking actually I'm taking garlic because we do have the uh Candle Labrador. And garlic is actually benefiting from the Candle Labrador insanely a lot. Like, really, really a lot. Thank you. Oh, would you look at that? Level 8. Yeah, yeah. Now when we hit 10 minute mark and then... Uh, get... Uh, get a chest. We are going to have ourselves some nice Labora. I still don't know what Labora is. There's a, there's a coffee named Labora, and also there's a, some places named, named Labora and stuff like that, you know, some hotels I do believe. I researched, actually, actually did. I googled it a couple times. Because I, because I was like, yeah, that, that's a pretty interesting name. You know, they, did they come up with it or, you know, is that something something in the world? And it seems that it's something something in the world, I don't know. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Oh, my um, Fridays. This latest power video just got uploaded. And we are talking about last Friday for you because I really don't know when this... This video is going out on Thursday, right? Yeah, on Thursday. So we are not talking about tomorrow. Oh, God. Oh. Sorry, we are talking about six days ago. Yes, I'm finally once again making a backlog. I'm actually able to do that. Mostly because this game is really fun. <laughs> and I love to play it. Um, not that I don't like the mortal scene, but the mortal scene... Right now, a as we speak, right now, a a as I speak actually, I'm uploading a video that's 96 point something something gigabytes big and huge. It's been uploading for about 18 hours now. No, 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 no. About 16 hours now. And it's on 70%. Exactly 70%. And that's why I don't record Mortal Sin that much. Still, I love the game. The game is really good. Especially because, you know, <laughs> absolutely nobody can buy it yet. <laughs> you know, I, I got, got it from the developer and the game is once again really great. But it takes shit ton of everything in time it's it's so so huge it's insane x 
Okay, we would benefit a lot from something that's called spinach. Or level 7x. And the King Bible. Okay. Oh, we took it, huh? Okay. Come on, Clarici. You can do it. Oh, yeah, our garlic is level 1. No wonder that I'm, I'm not do doing any damage with it. Ooh, level 8. Thingy there. Okay. So this bloodbath right now is, is like a, you know, strong enemy champion for now. But very soon it's not gonna be the Pumarola. Let's go. One thing that I wanted to see is... Oh. Huh. I forgot that the map exists now. Uh, max HP is 200 HP. I completely forgot about Pumarola. Uh, not about Pumarola, the map, I mean, and the... The update that happened a couple of days ago. The, um... <clears throat> you know, like, every map has... Map items now, and stuff like that, so that's good. And if we go down, all the way down, we will get the Pumarola. But it's not really worth going that... That much, you know. No. I didn't even see it there. Come on, that's unfair. Okay, at least I really got a lot of experience, which is really great, of course. Uh, Spellbinder, sure. Sorry, I was yawning over there. You know what? I don't want to kill that champion yet. I want to have more than 10 minutes and then kill the champion. If we manage to do it, never mind. So now I'm just not going to take the the chest before 10th minute and we should be fine. We should get an evolution. I'm not sure if we will, but we should. Oh my lordy. Oh my lordy. Oh, hello. Now oh, that's good. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna take the fire wand. It, it's a bad weapon, really. But the hellfire evolution is really great. And then the spinach, you know. More damage. And yes, I'm definitely not going for the vandalier this, this episode. Which is weird, I know. Which is really, really weird, but that's fine. You know, it, it's been 10 minutes and we still didn't get either Pichon or the, the Ebony Wing. So I do believe no use in that. Let's go with the King Bible. Oh yes, look at the knockback though. I'm just standing over here, nobody can, can come even near me at the moment. Mostly... What? Somebody came near me. Oh my lordy. Come on, there we go. An evolution. Thank you, we got Labora. And now look at this. Labora is helping. Labora is helping a lot. Oh, and as it comes closer, um, the area is becoming bigger, huh? That's nice. The area of effect is becoming bigger, you know. Cherry Bomb! Oh my god! We didn't get the Cherry Bomb in so long. But never mind, never mind that. I mean, Cherry Bomb is great and all, but still. Just like, you know. I want it evolved. You know, I, wa I want the evolutions. And I don't believe the Cherry Bomb will get an evolution anytime soon. I mean, it's a, it's a new weapon. I'm just gonna stand over here, by the way. <laughs> if you didn't realize by now. Let me see. 
If I turn that side... Oh, never mind. The um, Fire 1 doesn't care where I'm turned, right? Yeah, probably doesn't. I don't know. These guys are easy, okay? These guys are easy. That's why I'm standing in one place. And then we're just going to gather the experience. And that's about it. After, after the 12th minute. When somebody who is more challenging comes. C-U-M-S. Not C-O-M-S, but C-U-M-S. Oh, there they are. The um, werewolves, I guess. I don't know, maybe. So there's the red, 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 red crystal. There we go. The name is Crystal. Yes, please, the fire wand. No to the Pichon. Yes to the garlic. Yes to the attract orb. Yes to the garlic. Yes to the garlic. Yes to the garlic. Let's go. Let's go. That sight. That spiral. One of these days I'm going to get it correct, okay? Uh -uh. Scalomaniac not going to be taken. At least not at the moment. Scalomaniac can be taken when we have Undelir. Okay? That's about it. Or maybe we can get the Rune Tracer and the Scalomaniac. Huh, now that's interesting. There's the fire wand. We need a spinach. Spinach. Who made the game? I'm just kidding. You know, the notch and all that. I mean, Minecraft guy who made, made the Minecraft game and then sold it to Microsoft for millions and millions. Was it Microsoft? Yeah, I think it was. Or, you know, you know I, look, look. look. Back when that happened, happened, I was like 17, 16, 18, you know? And at that actual time, I didn't even have internet. Internet? Internet. Back, back in my hometown, you know, and stuff like that. My first interaction with internet was actually... Well, I cannot say first, because, you know, my friends had it in school, we had it. Um... But my own internet, I got it at the end of 2013. Actually, my dad got it, you know. And then after that, everything was fine. But I still didn't have, like, a strong PC to play different games and stuff like that. Like, I remember... Uh, reroll. Reroll. Spinach, there we go. I remember, like, um, look... Pirating stuff is still not illegal in Serbia. It should be. I'm completely up for that, but it still isn't. So I'm going to tell you a story. Back in 2000 and... Something... Can't really remember which year. You know what? Rune Tracer. And then we're going to try to fish for the Scalomaniac. Um, can't remember which year it was, but my brother... my, my Let's say... A cousin brought me a USB stick with Minecraft on it. Of course, it was pirated. And back then, my PC couldn't handle Minecraft. We, we, we're talking about the time like, I don't know, 2011 maybe? Maybe even 2010? Don't really know when, when Minecraft uh, became a thing, but still, yeah. So I had I had a really really bad computers until until I bought my own back in 2014 I would say 2015 maybe you know when I actually had my own money when I had when I got my job and stuff like that and uh, it still wasn't really a good PC like for today's standards even even for those standards it was like a, an AMD dual core with Nvidia. GT630, I would say, it was. Yeah, I think it was GT630. Or 6... No, 610. GT610. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I had that... Um, can't remember really, actually.
Like, until 2015, I remember that I used a PC that was from 2003. That was really, really extremely bad. But, however, even for that PC in 2014, uh, it was amazing. Like, I was able to play a lot of games that I wasn't supposed to basically play. I, I played even League of Legends back then on that thing. Okay, yes, maybe I played it on like 25, 30 FPS, but it was good, you know, at least I was able to play them. To, to play a lot of different games that I shouldn't be able to play. And then when I bought my, my dual core with 610 GT, GT 610 actually, um, I started recording videos for YouTube. <laughs> League of Legends, of course. Long time viewers, you'll know. Uh oh, no, 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 no. There we go, thank you. I, I saw, I saw the rosary and I was like, yes, we need that. So yeah, after that, I bought something else. Can't remember what, actually. It was a different PC. It was still a dual core. Or was it a quad? It was the PC that I had before this one, like, I, I, this PC I bought literally almost a full year ago, March of 2021. But funnily enough, I cannot remember what was my old PC. I know that I had a GTX 750 in it. And that PC is now, I, I, I gave it to my father, to my dad, because he... He had a laptop from like 20 years ago and it basically couldn't sustain absolutely anything, like not, not even YouTube, almost. So yeah. And um, can't remember the specifications, was it, was it a dual core or was it a quad core? I really have no freaking idea, I swear. But that's fine. Uh, most important thing is that now I have a strong PC, a really, really strong PC. And it's insane how good it is. Scalomaniac, let's go. Curse 40%, let's freaking go. Now, I do believe that I can actually just stand in one place, but I don't want to. I refuse to. In a way, except now. <laughs> I'm gonna do that right now. Because I'm trying to lift my... There we go. My um, coffee mug. I'm just gonna look at my phone a bit. Because absolutely nobody can touch me at the moment. Okay, nothing is happening there. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, we are still good. There we go. Oh, a triple! Let's go! We have a Hellfire. And the new level of Skullomaniac. Woohoo! Things are going to be weird at the moment. Rune Tracer, of course. So, I don't know. I guess that in the, in the, in the Dairy Plant, I'm actually just going to take the Rune Tracer every single game. Because I don't see any other any other way of winning there, you know? Like, I... With Poe and also with with uh, Llama, I really had strong builds, but like, those end guys are just insanely strong, I don't know. I don't know how to put it. Like, I do believe that I just need to, need to have the Rune Tracer and that would be it, you know? Let's take, let's take the experience because I want the Rune Tracer to be, the, the uh, Scalomaniac to be like the highest level possible at the moment. And I can bet we are going to be good. We are going to be good by the end. Especially because of the Rune Tracer, of course. One more level, okay. Is it the same sprite for Hellfire and Scalomaniac? I think it is. Just uh, different coloring, right? Yeah. Kind of 
Come on. Come on, a couple of more levels. Three more for Rune Tracer and one more for Scalomaniac. There we go. And now we're just gonna stand and try our best. <laughs> okay, this is going to be interesting. Oh, it is interesting. Oh boy. <laughs> okay, Rune Tracer coming in a clutch. Rune Tracer is going to be in the MVP over here, I can bet. I can bet whatever you want. Because the Rune Tracer is so damn strong, it's insane how strong it is. Evolution of the Rune Tracer, yay! Not gonna happen. Probably not anytime soon. You know what? I want to take the Attract Orb. Oh, do 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 And now just stand. Oh, we are actually still uh, receiving experience because I do believe that they are able to come near me. Actually, no. Yeah, our reach is so, so, so high that we can just basically take whatever we want from our kill point. Kill, kill radius, actually, not point. Oh yeah, the kill count is slow. <laughs> Growing ever so slowly. Big coin bag. 3k gold almost. Which is really great and good. And wake me up a bit later, thank you. Yeah, so just, you know. Nothing's happening, I mean, what, what can I do? Just sit over here, you know? Th this is by far the most boring stage of the game, like... What are those little guys even doing? Like, nothing, they're tanky and they're not dealing damage, you know, they, they're not even fast, like, come on, dudes. But after this, the plant ladies that come... Oh yeah, they, they are actually great and, and, and amazing. Okay, we're still not gonna take that. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to just wait as long as I can, and then in the end I'm gonna take the uh, the red gem that's gonna probably spawn already somewhere. But uh, yeah, just gonna just gonna take it a bit later, and that's it. Oh my lord, huh? Like, we, we, we are killing enemies exceptionally fast, quickly, whatever. There is just not so many of them. Which is very, very, very unfortunate. I still cannot remember what was the processor on my, on my old PC. It was AMD. Phantom 2. Nine six five, I think. There was nine four five, nine five five, and nine six five, and I think that my was nine six five. And it was a quad core. Is Phantom to a quad core? Bro, I cannot remember. Let me let me see. Of course, Google is my best friend, as always. Almost. Phantom 2 X4 955 965. There we go. Phantom, uh, Phantom 2 X4 965. 3.4 gigahertz. 
Now, let me see. Was that a quad core? I think it was. Yeah, quad core on 4 gigahertz system bus. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay, so it was a quad core. And I remember that the guy, my friend, who built it for me, of course, from used parts. I mean, you know, that was... Phantom 2 is from 2010 or something. I was like, I want an i5. And he was like, done. You know, you're, you're gonna get your i5. The Intel, of course. However, the i5 that he had, one day he called me and he was like, hey, this doesn't really work well because something something is wrong wrong with this, with this core, you know, the processor. And I don't want to sell it to you because, first of all, we, we are still to this day really great friends and this PC that I'm using right now, he himself built it and every other PC that I'm going to buy is going to be from him basically until he's alive because he's 30 years older than me. Exactly 30 years older than me. Um, and he was like, but I have something crazier. And I was like, oh, really? You have my attention? And he was like, yeah, just come come by to, to, to my shop today or tomorrow. You know? And I was like, okay. Then I came and he was like, this is an AMD. And I was like, oh. And he was like, yeah, I know. You don't like it. But my kid is using this. And uh, it's really, really good. And I was like, well, okay, you know, I need a PC, so yeah so i traded my old parts and my old pc basically the whole pc except the case and um, everything got in that amd phantom 2 x4 465 flexing with numbers and all that and two or three months later i bought the gtx 7 50 ti and holy damn it was amazing this was all back in 2016 holy yeah that was all back in 2016 actually scrap that it was all back in 2017 five years ago almost like four and a half years ago yeah, yeah, and un until March of last year, 2001, I actually used that PC, and holy moly, I sucked it so loud. I still to this day have no idea how that bucket <laughs> was able to work after, after all I did to it. I really have no freaking clue and idea. 2731, huh? That's interesting. 2731. Yeah, nothing is happening in the game. <laughs> I'm just standing. <laughs> the standing simulator, basically. Even with... Is that 90%? 80% curse. Even with 80% curse. It's the rune tracer. The rune tracer is just amazing, you know? Oh, really? Oh, really? You're gonna do me like that game? <laughs> okay, okay. No, 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 no. We need that one special... Um, one special red gem that's somewhere in this vicinity. Probably this one. Oh yeah, it's that one. Okay, that was good enough. Are we actually not going to be able to survive? Because we have a, you know, a curse of 80% and then... The Candle Labrador that's making absolutely everything huge and big and you know my oh my god i'm gonna die i'm actually actually going to die my um unholy vespers is so huge and not so fast they cannot defend me well that's why i actually don't really like the candle labrador and i didn't want to take it from the since the beginning but still i did it you know i just did it 
Some builds really don't go well with Candle Labrador at all. Like, at all. It, it would actually be much better if I took the... Um, what's the name of that thing? The knives. Would be much better with Candle Labrador because my knives would be huge. And big. There's a floor chicken. <laughs> oh my lordy. Do I actually need to heal? Do I actually... I'm gonna die. I'm, I'm j j Dudes, I'm gonna die. Holy damn. <laughs> oh, this is hilarious. Hilarious. Hilarious? I'm just kidding. Bruh. Bruh, I need a level. I need a level up. I need a level up. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, okay. Come on, dude. Survive, please. A couple more seconds. You need a couple more seconds only. Nothing else. <laughs> nope. Oh, finally. Let's go. Jesus Christ. That's fine. <laughs> I'm okay with this. <laughs> oh, boy. Anyway, don't take Candle Labrador with Unholy Vespers. Well, the King Bible. But the Unholy Vespers. Just do not take it. Ever. It's bad. It's really, really bad. Anyway, if you did enjoy this video, please leave a rating, eat or like or dislike, and let me so, so much. Leave a comment down the section below. Subscribe for more videos like this. And as always, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time.